Welcome back to Fox 43 AM Live. Join us now is Matthew Waits, and with him are the mischievous Hank Too Tall for the Shelf Elf and his Elf in Training Harley. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Pleasure to have you guys on the show today. And you now, Hank, I started following you on Facebook. You. You've been delighted kind of traveling around the Topeka area, taking yes. pictures, bringing Christmas cheer. Um, so to start off, how did this all start? What are you guys kind of up to being too tall for the shelf elf here? So about two years ago, I dressed up as this for Halloween. And everyone just loved it. And we thought we could do something with it for Christmas. Like a countdown I would hope to Christmas. so, yes. Yeah, so. <laughs> We decided to do a countdown to Christmas. And okay, so yeah, you're doing a countdown to Christmas, kind of a, a, a new picture every day, right? That's right. Yeah. And yeah, what's your uh, what's your plan with the pictures now? Like, where are you? Where do you kind of decide to go to? And kind of what, what's your what do you do exactly? Um, so sometimes bin businesses like to invite us out and take pictures and um, advertise their businesses and stuff. So that kind of decides wh where, where mm -hmm. we go every time. So. Oh, that's fun. Yeah. And, and now we were talking a little bit earlier before the show started. It's been a whirlwind of a couple of years now that you guys, that you started doing this mm -hmm. where uh, you, you had, you've had some special visits as well. We and it's also some special um, affiliates at this point too, if you want to get into a little bit of that. Yeah. So last year I got to visit Governor Laura Kelly at her uh, mansion. Uh, this year, uh, we did a partnership with Crocs, <laughs> um, and we've been to the zoo. We've the mall has invited us out to take some pictures. So yeah, that's a lot of fun. Yeah. And so now, as well, um, you're expanding. It's not just pictures. You're actually giving more back to the community. You're helping out some senior citizens. Is that right? That's Through right. the Christmas Bureau. Yeah. Yeah. yeah uh, explain. What's what's your mission there? So we're taking donations. Um, and we're gonna like buy presents mm -hmm. and everything for um, elderly people that are housebound, and because we believe that everybody should like enjoy that Christmas spirit and wake up that morning with Christmas uh, presents under the tree. Oh, that's yeah. touching. I love that. I, I love that it started yeah. out as like a Halloween costume, <laughs> and, and we were saying like it's kind of snowballed into this little Christmas adventure you guys are on now. Yeah. Um, and so Matthew, yes. I'll turn to you. How did you got? How did you get wrapped up into this? Well, actually, I, I know these guys uh, from working in the North Pole mm -hmm. uh, recently, the past couple of years. Um, so they're not only uh, active in the community like we are, and that's how we met. Uh, but we're working with them right now to help donate to their cause. Wonderful. So in our shop, we actually have a certain uh, section. If you buy from that, we will match that 100% from now until December 22nd. And okay. we'll donate all those proceeds. Cool. So what do you have in that section there? So in that section is our, we have a special room that's build your own pack at our sports mm -hmm. card store. So if you come in and build your own pack uh, for $5, we donate that five dollars plus we match that five dollars oh, fantastic yeah, that's yeah. wonderful yeah. and this is o's hobby shop by that's the right. way you didn't mention it yourself yeah. i think so, we got yeah. on the lower third there so, no one uh, forget that yeah o's hobby shop uh, it's on gauge and we're open uh tuesday through saturday awesome and so also with your guys's donations and um you're raising money obviously for the christmas bureau for this for your kind of seniors yeah. how can people um the best way to reach out to you guys, or if beyond presents, I saw you guys were also doing blessing boxes and silverbacks, yeah, yeah. all wrapped up together there. So the leftover um, donations, we will be going out and like buying food mm -hmm. and warm clothing and donating that to silverbacks, which is, um, it, they go out and give these things to um, homeless, homeless people. people. Oh, yeah. stuff. Okay, wonderful. Yeah, and then the blessing boxes, we would go put like stuff in there mm -hmm. and people can come get it as they need. Great. And so now I know people can reach out to you to um, your Facebook page, which is Hank Too Tall yeah. for the Shelf Elf. So people can reach out to you guys, can possibly donate some money or get you guys some items somehow. I think, Matthew, That's we're right. talking. We can drop some stuff off with you. Absolutely. So anytime between Tuesday and Saturday from now until the 22nd, you can come to the shop and we... Uh, we'll take all the donations from there. Awesome. I, I'm wonderful system. I'm so glad you guys are out there helping out the community. And Hank, where are you off to next now? Where are you guys going to be visiting in the next count as if we count down to Christmas? So this weekend, I'm actually going to Blue Jazz Coffee. Um, I have a thing out there. Um, then next week, we, have, we just have some more things planned. 
So, all right. Yeah. I can't wait to keep up with you guys. <laughs> this is going to be a fun holiday season. I can't wait to see what happens next year. You guys seem to, every year, top yourself, I hope. Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do next year. <laughs> you better start planning. December 26th. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> start thinking up for the next year. All right. Yeah. Well, hey, thank you guys for joining us this morning. It's been an absolute pleasure. Yeah, and again, everyone, um, if you want to keep up with Hank and his trainee, you can head on over to their Facebook page, Hank Tuton for the Shelf Elf.